My name is Alex Abdo, and I'm a staff attorney at the American Civil Liberties Union. The ACLU is the oldest and biggest civil rights organization in the United States. We have projects ranging from classic First Amendment freedoms to uh, gender equality, uh, racial equality, equality for those in the LGBT community. Uh, and we work a lot on uh, privacy and surveillance. Secure communication is fundamental uh, for the work that I do. Uh, we use a lot of different uh, encryption technologies, but probably none more important than GPG. Uh, it allows us you know, to communicate by email with clients who otherwise wouldn't come to us, uh, with reporters uh, who wouldn't communicate about the same subject matters with us without uh, GPG, uh, and also fellow advocates across uh, the world. I probably communicate on any given day with uh, about a dozen different people using GPG. I've been surprised at how many lawyers at the ACLU have now made GPG a part of their daily, uh, you know, their daily experience. Uh, lawyers who I uh, would not beforehand have <laughs> uh, have ever thought to ask to, you know, uh, to use a tool as sophisticated as GPG. There's some clients. Uh, who are very explicit when they communicate with us, that they have certain uh, expectations of confidentiality uh, and they want uh, the best technological guarantee they can get. Uh, actually, just a couple days ago, uh, somebody reached out to me uh, as a possible client uh, using GPG uh, and uh, an anonymous email provider. Uh, and uh, I'm certain that, that this individual would not have contacted us except using uh, GPG. Uh, and there are reporters who uh, demand a similar sort of confidentiality, particularly if they want to share with us a document. Uh, maybe uh, a source has given them, you know, leaked to them uh, a very sensitive government document and they want our reaction to it. They want us to help them understand the significance of the document. Uh, and they wouldn't share it with us unless they could do it in a secure way. And GPG is the default. For some of the people we communicate with, uh, their main worry is the U.S. government. Uh, for others, uh, they're worried about leaving uh, any sort of trace because they may have other concerns. Um, you know, so for example, uh, we defend the rights of people to speak anonymously online. Uh, and the people who, who want to speak anonymously online will take a number of measures to protect their anonymity. Uh, you know, encryption alone doesn't provide you anonymity, but it is usually a part of uh, the set of tools that these people will use to communicate securely. Uh, and so, you know, it's not just the U.S. government. There are a variety of uh, people who might be listening in who our clients, our sources, uh, want to evade. GPG is the industry standard when it comes to securing your emails. So when we have people who want to communicate with us via email uh, and they want to ensure that it is verifiably secure, that's what they'll use. Uh, you know, we will use encrypted uh, phone services as well, which rely on public key cryptography, and um, uh, that's also important to the work that we do. But I think at the end of the day, we're lawyers, and so we're going to be exchanging documents and emails, and uh, the core of that is, uh, you know, the security for that is GPG.